when you wake up in the morning, you never roll to the left because you could cause some minor damage to the system. That right side is more stable, left side is more vulnerable. There are studies, if you're left-handed, then uh, you could live less. In Hatha Yoga, whether Surya Namaskar or Asanas, why do we always begin with the right side first? Because it's right. <laughs> you want to do it on the wrong side <laughs> Oh, because it's masculine. Uh, both physiologically, energy-wise and psychologically, Right is the more stable side. Stability also comes with rigidity. This is an inevitable factor. Whatever is stable is also rigid. To make yourself very fluid and still be stable takes work. This is why <laughs> The yogis fell in love with mercury, fluid but super stable. The only thing like that. So we love mercury because so fluid and so stable. Right side is more stable and also somewhat more rigid. Physiologically, if you go start with the body, physiologically, Left side is little more fragile because left has the responsibility of having your heart, which has many layered significance in the physiology, not just of pumping blood, it has a many layered significance. And you don't start that side. In India, we told you, even when you wake up in the morning, you roll to the right and get up. You never roll to the left because the first movement that you make, if you make to the left, you could cause some minor damage to the system. You always roll right. And also, as large part of the land mass on the planet is largely in the northern hemisphere, and human populations, eighty-eight percent of human population is in the northern hemisphere. And in the northern hemisphere, there are many forces within the system which function like this, so this is why always right. So immediately people from Australia will ask this question, should I start with left? No. Just because you're going the wrong way, you don't have to continue that way <laughs> You must start with right because Physiologically, it is so, psychologically, it is so, energy-wise, it is so that right side is more stable, left side is more vulnerable. So always with the right, even if you wake up in the morning, on the right, first movement should happen on the right side, not on the left side. There is… there are studies which clearly say that those who are left-handed, they tend to live less than right-handed people. Do you know this? You're left-handed. If you're left-handed, if you're constantly using your left hand more than your right hand, then uh, you could live less on an average compared to right-handed people. Of course, life and death has so many other factors involved, but this could reduce one's lifespan because left is a vulnerable space. It needs to follow, it should not be the upfront. So, always on the right. <laughs>